telehandler man lift rented for another three days and originally we were going to continue working on our exterior siding. However, all of the rustic tongue and groove arrived for our great room ceiling and our master bedroom accent wall and we cannot wait to see what it looks like. So instead of working on siding today, we decided to tackle one of those projects instead. Melissa and I decided on four different colored stains for all this tongue and groove material. Each one of those colors is separated into an individual stack. Everything is bundled up and wrapped face to face so we don't know what it looks like as of yet. We were previously provided with tiny little samples. I just want to see what it looks like up on the wall. It's hard to get a feel for things unless you can see it on a grand scale on our own lighting. This is so exciting. Let's do it! Get things moved over. <laughs> you like walking backwards? It's like Christmas. Dark chocolate, that was nice. Oh, that was nice too. This one is not right. So it's been two hours since we originally decided that we were going to check out this wood. There was one color in particular that just didn't go with the other colors. It wasn't quite what we had pictured in our minds. And since this is our forever home, we don't want to settle and just put it up on the wall, so. Yeah, so that was a little frustrating. We contacted the company, we kind of went into scramble mode and they were great. They came right out um, and reassured us that they would do whatever it takes to make us happy, which we were very uh, grateful for because yeah, this is our forever home, like she said. And so all of these decisions and materials that we're using, it's of the utmost importance to us. We want to get it looking exactly how we had it pictured and envisioned in our minds. Right, but since these colors are going to be all switched up, we cannot do anything until we have all four colors. So they're gonna pick them up, re-sand them, re-stain it, re-deliver it. It's gonna be a couple days so we can actually get to work on the project that we probably should have been working on anyway. We're gonna get back to work on the siding and the gable ends. We're gonna get the board batten up. We do have the telehandler lift here for only a couple more days. Right. So yeah, maybe ultimately this is all for the best and uh, everybody will be happy in the end. It is however later in the day and Nevea has her very last driver's ed. Last one, woohoo! Oh. Hallelujah, it has been a long two months. So she finds out today if she passed her test and if she did, we will have a permitted driver. I'm sure she'll do fine. So while you guys are there, we're gonna get head start on tomorrow so we can get up and running really quickly. I'll get all the backers set, I'll get the block set. Should be good to go. Okay, don't crash. Mom, we've been over this. Classroom. Okay, wear your seatbelt. Okay. Bye. While Nevaeh is in driver's ed, I'm going to relax in the car. I'm going to get caught up on that show that I keep falling asleep while we're watching. And I'm going to eat some popcorn cheesy balls. Normally when I come to town, I have to go grocery shopping because we do live really far from the grocery store. But my Thrive grocery box just arrived, which means I actually get some alone time in my car where it's quiet with just me and my cheesy balls. So I go on and on, not only to you guys, but also to all of my friends and all of my family. But if you don't already know, Thrive Market is an online membership-based grocery store on a mission to make healthy living affordable and easy for everyone. With Thrive Market, you can shop from the comfort of your couch or your car or your work. You'll find thousands of the best-selling organic foods and natural products below traditional retail prices. The coolest part is if you do happen to find a lower price, Thrive will match it. I've now switched to organic mango. When you shop on Thrive, get this. This has replaced candy for my kids. Thrive Market has an amazing selection of organic groceries, snacks, supplements, eco-friendly cleaning supplies, non-toxic beauty, even wine, meat, frozen foods, and more. Shopping Thrive is so easy. You can filter the catalog of products by diet or lifestyle. So whether you're gluten-free, paleo, raw, or vegan, Thrive Market takes all the guesswork out of finding what you need. And my favorite part of the whole thing, the part that made my day today, is everything ships free to your door with every order over $49. So this is how it works. Thrive has two membership options. They have a monthly membership for $9.95 a month, or they have an annual membership, which is $59.95. That's only five bucks a month. And right now they're offering our viewers an incredible deal, like a stock up on everything. Unbelievable. I really want that deal deal. All you have to do to try out Thrive for yourself is click the link in our description below or go to thrivemarket.com slash good simple living. You will get 40% off guys, 40% off your entire order off already low prices, plus a free gift worth $50 when you join Thrive today. Did you pass? I did. I'm all done with driver's ed, and those are my gluten free snacks. Why, why are you my gluten free snacks?
Today is Nevaeh's first school dance. Mm. So I've been entrusted to do her hair because we don't live by any salons. So <laughs> here we go. All right, we're starting with a light mist conditioner. Okay, now we're gonna do a styling cream. And I'm gonna do a little of this. Oh, the moves. You're gonna need more than that. Divide in two. I don't remember if I twist the bottom. I need the Google. Okay, and then you take a piece. How far do you waterfall it? Do you waterfall it all the way around? I feel like I made the twist too thin. Now I have to repeat what I don't know how to do. More conditioner. <laughs> What's this now? If anyone walks in this part of the house today, they're gonna fall. <laughs> <laughs> the water falling is falling apart. No. <laughs> this is easier than the siding? No. The siding makes sense. This. Mm-mm. The face framing curls, they're important. They're the cause of all my acne. <laughs> <laughs> Won't that be nice? <laughs> okay, so your date's gonna be here in five hours. I will come in in four to help you. Don't move. Okay. We got Nevaeh's hair done and her date will be here in about five hours. It is absolutely pouring today. It's really, a milestone, but a huge nerve-wracking occasion to put our daughter in the car she, with a teenager, especially on a day like today. She has never gone on a date or gone to a dance or ridden in a car with anyone under 21 or done any of this kind of stuff. You're just rattling off a bunch of reasons we shouldn't let her go. That's all you're doing right now. <laughs> I know, like when you homeschool your children, you don't have those natural milestones that you dread as a parent, like the first day of kindergarten or elementary school graduation, those things that kind of prepare you for a day like today. So we're just kind of being thrown into this after protecting her for all of these years. I don't know what you're talking about. I've been planning a speech I'm going to give to this kid for years, <laughs> Melissa. Since the day they laid her in your arms. Better watch yourself, son. <laughs> yeah, no, seriously, watch yourself. <laughs> so today, like I mentioned, is absolutely pouring. It is the worst day to be working outside, on siding, on a metal lift, going up and down metal ladders. So we're crossing our fingers for a break in this weather. Yeah. But I think we need to kind of wait it out for a little bit. Kind of wait it out. It's just kind of a weird, busy day yeah. overall. You can see I already got everything set up here on our basket little platform workstation. I'm going to park it under the overhang so all our stuff doesn't get wet. It's not good for it. Time keeps on slipping like sand through my Let's see if it lets up. I honestly can't believe I'm as old as I am. The moon keeps on pulling the tides of this water, but who would have thought we'd have a blue eyed daughter? Oh, blue eyed. Looks like we're lucky now to catch a nice little quick break in the weather here. Let's head back up and see if we can get done. I can see my breath Waiting on the cafe Like waiting on a bed I wish I had a castle To guard you from all fear this little spider cocoon up there for you on the ladder. <laughs> take that out. No, don't take it out. What if they fall on me? It's gonna be like a hundred little tiny spiders. Oh. You're good. You're good. Seems like it, huh? I haven't seen that for a while. In our last video where we were doing this, there were a number of you down in the comment section asking us how it is that we were managing to achieve the proper angle on the top of each one of these boards. Basically what we've been doing is working off an existing edge. We take a top to bottom measurement. I already marked it on the wall here. It's 77 inches. And for the short edge, taking this little sample piece, 
marking where it is that we're working on the wall, same thing, make a top to bottom measurement. We transfer both of those over, make a mark, draw a line, cut to the edge. It's been working out great. I am so happy the sun came out, not only because finally we can come out and work for a little bit, but because I was feeling really, really nervous about Nevaeh riding on the road with it raining. So this is good. This makes me feel better, a little bit. <laughs> This is the last one I can comfortably get to. You want to go in, help Nevaeh after this? Yeah, I think he's supposed to be here in like 20 minutes. Right. Okay now, Jeremy, you need to be nice, all right? You're assuming he's gonna show up on time? He better show up on time. And he'll be on time. What do you think, guys? Does he look pretty? Yeah, yeah, she looks like a princess. Like a princess? wonder how many other girls going to the prom are getting ready in their barn. Mm -hmm. Just us? <laughs> what do you think, how many she look good? Mm-hmm. You're next. You excited? Makeup, hair, come on, man. Show everybody your shoes. You gonna be able to do the washing machine in those? You do the twist? There, oh. I don't think she needs <laughs> dancing advice from you. Maybe a little sprinkler, huh? That's exactly how I dance. Okay. No pressure. <laughs> yeah, no pressure. No pressure. Oh, all right. I got it. There you go. So, we'll put that one in the center. Good. That'll hold your hair. So, Seth's mom owns a and runs a flower farm. How convenient is that? <laughs> you know your short mother can't see. <laughs> Ready to go? Ready. Okay. You guys have fun. Be careful. Alright, we will. Be very smart. Thank you. Drive Good. carefully. Yep, yeah, thank you. <laughs> Alright, I just want to check to see if you opened the door for her when they were getting in the car. Did you he? doing okay? Yeah, I think he did. Are you doing okay? <laughs> I'm doing okay. It's just weird. It's weird that we're old enough to have a daughter <laughs> <laughs> going to prom and it's just I don't know it's just weird my mind can't keep up with this yeah she's our firstborn child and this is a new experience for us so yeah. it's just really really weird and I don't know it's a good kid decent kid and I was very nice right you were very nice trying to be very respectful of the fact that I'm sure he was a little nervous coming in here yes so yeah hopefully they have a good time they make it back everybody stays safe and makes smart decisions yeah. most importantly yes with Nevaeh out of the house for the next few hours, I'm going to head back out here and get as much work done as I can. It'll help keep my mind distracted from just her being away. I can't help but worry when she's off and alone, kind of by herself. So, got a couple hours of daylight left. Let's see what I can get done.
Well, we all survived yesterday. We're feeling a lot more relaxed today. We have one more day with this lift. We definitely have a full day of work ahead of us and we are racing against this weather. A lot to do, let's go. the whole house with a toothbrush. I'll be done next week. Have fun. Don't forget the floss. <laughs> okay, this far half is officially done. Let's get the other half completed. It's starting to rain. We're not done yet. Just wait a second. We need like two hours. Come on. Two hours? Okay, maybe three. Show of hands, who's not having fun right now? Can I let go? No, don't. <laughs> <laughs> We've reached the point of the gable wall where we have to cut some notches out to get around these blocks and the way we're going to do that is just take a very careful particular series of measurements. We'll transfer those measurements onto our board, plot everything out, draw some lines, and hopefully it works. Usually it works out just fine. We'll see how it goes. Watch me screw this up royally again like last time. Jinx myself just because, yeah, it usually works out. <laughs> Raining. Man. No? Not what you're going for? Almost done. Come on. Keep going. I'll just be here waiting for spring. <laughs> it's almost spring. This week, as we continued on our home build, we were faced with a few challenges between supplies and schedules and bad weather. But really, this whole week was just sort of a blur. We reached two major milestones with our firstborn child, and that had our minds and our energy elsewhere. It was sort of like trying to work through a fog. Somehow the years just got away from us and so many of our firsts are now lived through the lives of our children. And here we are, once again like teenagers. We're trying to sort out this mix of emotions ranging from pride to crippling fear. We're trying to learn when to tighten our grip and when to loosen it. We have a lot of new firsts ahead of us and we have no way of knowing how this next chapter in our story will unfold. The funny thing is, as you grow up and you experience so many exciting firsts, you don't realize that you'll experience them all again. Only instead of sitting in the driver's seat, you're now just a spectator. But you're a spectator with the scariest, most anticipated, and by far the best seats in the house.